Hello, everybody. Welcome back to my channel for another episode of the Nasa Berry Challenge. So, um, in the last part, we got married, um, and, uh, got pregnant accidentally. It was completely accidentally. Um, oh, I meant to hit clean, not throw up. <laughs> um, But, um, it was, it was just, it was actually funny because I remember playing it and being, kind of thinking, I was like, don't I have the thing where, like, you can, f like, your pregnancy can fail? Like, like, not the pregnancy, sorry. The, um, that the pr contraceptive can fail and she ended up pregnant. <laughs> I was like. But it was like my brain knew. Um, it's like it knew. Um, I am going to play with Oliver because he needs, because he is also in the detective career and he's only like level two, I think. Maybe one. I'm going to play as him because she doesn't need to, I don't need to because her things are, her requirements are filled. So I'm just going to have her go to work and I'm going to have his requirements be filled up as well. I wonder if she'll actually show up. Oh, it's winter. Um, when he comes back from work, we'll have them move out. I have a house figured out. I don't remember what house that was, though. Okay. Yeah, 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 I'm on patrol. We all know this. I'm just going to probably speed through here because, like, you guys don't need to see this. You've already seen it. He's not the heir. I just want them to, I just want him to get like promotions so we can have more money. Cause in the house that I want to move into, I feel like we barely can afford it. Do I remember what house that is? No, no, I do not. Um, I wonder if Chrysanthemum is here. No, don't see her. Why the heck do they never show up? <laughs> Yay, got promoted. Okay, um, now I just need to make sure. Do you have to call all the chickens in the coop before I take it or what? I don't know if I'm actually gonna keep it. The chickens can be kind of annoying and I really don't need that many eggs. My God, y'all slow, aren't you? Did her thing not go up at all? Okay. And then I'm pretty sure everything else can just be replaced. I don't think there's anything else here of any necessity. So I'm just going to have Oliver move. Okay, I do not remember where we were going. Like my memory is shit. I just can't live in a waste of springs. I think it was Evergreen Harbor. I went through every single, no, it wasn't. It was this one. It was this house, I believe. It was at this one. It was this one. Yep, I remember. Oh, we'll just sell the furniture. What do you mean unfurnished? Why is it unfurnished? No, 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 no. <laughs> Why is there no freaking... I don't want to furnish this. Hold on. Okay, well. This is what I did. 
Um, I have no idea what the original house looked like, so this is just kind of what I, you know, whatever. I could not find a shoe rack. I was looking everywhere for the shoe rack, and I could not find it. So there isn't one. I just have this little mud room, which is, like, you know, sweater, scarf. Walk in, there's a living room. Um, the fireplace is kind of in a weird space. I would have liked it to be here. But I also, you know, watch TV. That's one thing about the Snowy Escape things is they, they didn't have any TVs in them. Um, because you're supposed to go out snowboarding. But, like, if you're actually going to live here, you're not going to be snowboarding all the time, you know? Um, little, 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 have, whatever these things are. I don't know what they're called, and I don't want to pronounce it and be wrong. We got this, and then the little kitchen. I had no idea what to do with the kitchen. The kitchen was probably the hardest. Um, I don't know what to put in here. And then there's a little bathroom. I don't like how that's a yellow light and then a bright. Um, so let's make it a yellow light. There we go. Um, and upstairs, you come in. There's another bathroom here. This is the master bedroom. This will be the baby's room. And this is um, Lacey. I need to fix her name. I don't know why it's in all caps. Um, right now I have chrysanthemum over here. She is, because I just simply did not want to deal with it. Um, do not believe... I should I shouldn't have any challenges yeah okay there are no challenges good I don't want any um and so I'm back so I don't need that anymore I just the chickens are too much work to take care of that I simply do not have the energy for um she is in her, she's in her second trimester. She will be popping out this baby any minute now. She's huge, but this family tend to have very big pregnancy bellies. Um, how are you doing? You're not married? Come on, girl, get married. Um, but yeah, I've actually never lived in one of these houses before. I've never lived in um, Mount Komorobi or whatever it's whatever it is. Um, Snowy Escape just kind of ended. Yeah, I have no idea what to put here, like at all. I do have to get her her little light. Cause I'm not. I don't want to deal with nightmares. You really don't. Oh, her skin is back to her normal shade. Good. She's huge. Like she, her tummy is so big. Like, I, mm. I want to see if she's having more than one. Should we have her, like, go to the doctors and we can find out what the gender is? There's really no need for you to use a condom. She's pregnant. I, you can't get pregnant again. Yeah. Auto lights. All lights. Ooh. Honey, why are you naked? Why? Why are you napping and not sleeping? I do have an MC command center where your sims actually get naked during woohoo. I feel like it just makes more sense. Because, like, when they're wearing their pajamas, it kind of is just, like, not actually woohoo. It's just messing around, and I don't 
doesn't doesn't feel right, you know? It doesn't it doesn't seem right. Does she work today? She does. Maybe we could have her go to the doctors. And in reality, she's like, we're going to say she's going to the wonderful store when really that means that she's going to the doctors. Okay, so she's going to the doctors. That's not it. So we'll see what she's even thinking about the baby. Look at that. She's thinking about the bottle. She is having, oh my God, please be a boy. She's having twins. She is. Ha She's having two girls. Oh my god. Oh, she's like. Oh no. <laughs> oh, that's how I feel. Oh my god. I wanted a boy. Why? Why is the firstborn born, born's always girls? Why is that a thing? It's bull crap. Oh my god. She is having a boy. I remember I need to get a heating center thingy. You know what? We're also going to get one of these just in case because I don't trust. Okay. Not only is it a girl, which I did not want a girl because I'm tired of the firstborns always being girls. They're also twins. Which is... They didn't even want this baby yet. Like, what is this? Ma'am, what are you doing? Clean. Why the hell is she? Oh, honey, you need to change your clothes. You can't just walk around nude. Why are you? You don't have to pee. Okay, so it says that she's del delirious, so we're gonna call in sick to work. Because she is feeling, she is actually sick, so. She's feeling delirious. Okay, so she has twins. She has not, you know, told anyone yet. Um, she's kind of still trying to wrap her head around it. Um, and, you know, husband was like, hey, what's up? And she was like. Nothing, because like I don't know, she just didn't want to say anything. I think she's still trying to process everything, which like I get, like that's like oh my god, there's two of them, which I was kind of thinking. I was like, I mean, I was, I was like, she's really big, but at the same time, like everyone in this family typically has pretty big pregnancy bellies, so I was also kind of like, nah, she ain't pregnant, no way. Oh, was I wrong? Or, no way she's having twins. She's obviously pregnant. Um, no way is she having twins. Okay, well, there's nothing else we can really do at the moment. So, I'm just going to have her practice her piano skill. Um, which is almost six, which I believe six is what I said would be considered playing an instrument. And she can just kind of do it whenever. But that's as far as I'm going to be like, okay, she's there. Um, which is almost then actually um oh neighbors um her gourmet cooking is six and her comedy is eight so not horrible could definitely do better though i've never 
Can you not steal my goddamn food? I wish you could yell at your sims. Oh my god, she's... We're having twins. Now I have to find out another name. Because, like, for the girl, I said it would be Matcha. And they're living in... He's non-committable and a loner. And a perfectionist. You must be a pain. I just, I can't believe she's having twins. My... Uh, why? Yep, just leave a bunch of strangers in your house. That's fine. Hey, you all saw that I was heavily pregnant. You should, like, really clean up for me. That'd be great. No? Lacey. Oh my god. I had no idea that if you lived here, your kids actually had to wear a uniform. I didn't know that was a thing. That makes me so happy. Okay. Oh, I didn't get to see who that was. We are going to call our siblings, though. Sylvia and Sebastian, because we haven't seen them in a while. Going to give our friends a bit of a chit-chat, because we haven't seen them in a while either. You know, been pregnant and kind of just not in the mood to deal with people. I love that they have uniforms. That makes me uncontrollably happy. Okay. Well, she has not told her husband that yet because you know like I said she was still trying to process it so like she went to the went to the thing he was gone um well he was asleep and then um he woke up and he had to kind of like he couldn't really stay and talk much because he had to run, to run to work but he was like hey babe how was how was the appointment and she was like oh yeah it's good you know um things are fine things are good baby health healthy you know um He's like, oh, great, wonderful, happy to hear. And, you know, they don't really think much of it. No, you are not just eating this cheese. Do we not have any? We do not. Okay. So, Mama, you're going to have to come down here and you're going to have to cook because we need your skill to go up. Um, We're going to make... A rack of lamb, huh? Mm -hmm. I'm just going to do butternut squash soup because that sounds really nice in this weather with the snow and stuff. Alright, we're going to tell them about what... Sit next to him, please. Why can't I sit down? The f fuck? That makes no sense why I can't sit next to him. Alright, well we're just going to tell them that we're pregnant with twins and they're both girls. And... Um, she's happy that she's getting sisters because boys are gross and icky and she didn't want any brothers, so that makes her happy. And he's, of course, like, twins. What? I cannot imagine having twins. That would be awful. It, it would be. Alright, well, with that, uh, no, you know, he's like, okay, yeah, we'll bring one more baby, you know. Um, oh, 
which is, you know, he was like, oh, great. Maybe we didn't even try for, and now there's two of them. You know, he's happy, of course. You know, it's just like, oh, we're very recently married, and we already, you know, it was kind of already scary that we were going to have, like, the stepdaughter. Or her stepdaughter is his daughter, but, you know. He, you know, he was worried about that, but she was very accepting of it. She, you know, she, she likes Lacey. They don't know each other enough to say that it's love, but, you know. But she does care for Lacey. Um, and it's just that they were just hoping to have a little bit longer of a time together before they had kids. So, you know, you're supposed to have a higher cooking level. What is your cooking level? Two, you're supposed to have a much higher cooking level. What the heck? I'm going to give you a level nine because that's what you are. And gourmet. I'm going to give you a seven. When did I stop recording? When on earth did it stop recording? There was no, I've never, <gasps> I was like, I don't remember ever hitting stop recording. I was adjusting all of her skills, and I hit seven. Well, basically, I rearranged the living room, um, and they had the babies. And her skill went up, and her piano skill, I believe. We got a baby. So we got Matcha and Jade. Matcha is probably, she was born first. So that's probably going to be the one that ends up you know, being the heir, but we'll also create Jade and use her as I would normally. Like how I did with Cherry and Mac, I, you know, whatever, okay. I'm gonna make, I'm gonna make their cribs green. It's kind of rare that I actually get to do that. I also just, I forget. Um, but I can change it. So we'll put one over there and one over here. We'll put them on opposite ends. On the right side, we got bunk beds now. I don't know which one is which. This is matcha. So this is probably will be the oldest. Where are they? Okay, oh. mm. we're going to have you come breastfeed. You're going to come. Oh, it's stinky dapper. You're going to come. Do this. We got three girls. We got a house full of girls. Poor Oliver. Yep. The baby just is gone. We're gonna woohoo with her husband. We probably shouldn't. Like, it's very, it's not recommended. Like, in reality, do not have a baby. And then immediately do the do. do, the do because um, that's not good. You're healing. Um, and, you know, you just pushed a baby out of your hoo ha. So do not be putting anything else up your hoo ha <laughs> until it's healed. Okay? Thank you. Um, that's my PSA. Um, when do babies age up? In a week. Well, probably age them up sooner than that because, you know. Um, I just wish that they would, like, change back into their clothes after they boohooed naked. Like, whatever. Um, are you, can you... 
Are they going to have any more kids? I don't fucking know. Why are you asking me this? They just barely had a baby. Um, I'm going to be talking to myself. Why am I asking myself this? I don't know. I honestly don't know. Because I... Kind of like fine with this type of family dynamic that they have at the moment. They have three girls. Um, I just, I kind of have like an idea of how many kids my sims are going to have when I create them. Like, I mean, it's kind of like, that's how it is in real life. Like, you kind of have like an idea of like, oh, I want this many kids. Is that what happens? I don't know. But, um, the fact that this baby was already kind of unplanned, both of them, and we did also just barely have them, it's kind of like... Oh my god. Thank you. Did you Why are they glitching? Right, that's fair. You just saw your stepmom naked. I can I can appreciate the um not wanting to be there. I I can I get that. That's awkward. Why did she walk downstairs naked? I don't know. Um. I'm gonna have her write some jokes. I'm gonna have her come here and meet her siblings. Alright, she's happy. She's happy. Cool, good. I'm glad. Um, now you need to you need to come here and do your freaking homework. Thank you, Dad. I don't know what you can do. He wants to go on dates with his wife because he has a soulmate aspiration. He wants to go on a date, but yeah, her piano is not quite six yet. Do not touch my baby. I can take care of my own damn child. Thank you. I hate when Sims do that. It's like, stop. I can take care of my own kid. Thank you. Typically the majority of the time they're already in the process of taking care of them when you do this. There is no need. See what I mean? Leave my damn kids alone. I can fucking do it. Okay, well, you know what? Okay, hold on. I want to end this episode here because I've been I've been recording for a while. So, um, if you enjoyed, please do like, comment down below what you thought, and what you'd like to see next. Subscribe if you're new, and I'll see you all in the next episode. Bye guys.